Hi, I'm Susan from Susie's Book Basket. Today I want to share with you some of our brand new chapter books. Lots of great titles. Let's take a look. Monsters in the Dark is the first book in a brand new series called Billy and the Mini Monsters. This brand new original series is designed for kids ages six and up and it is full of wonderful full color illustrations to keep reluctant readers reading. Billy is a little boy who's afraid of the dark because he doesn't know what lurks there. My eight-year-old fluent reader loves this adventurous little book. Another brand new series is Fairy Unicorns. The series has some of the same characters in it, but you don't need to have read Fairy Ponies in order to enjoy the Fairy Unicorn series. Magic Forest is the first book in a six book series, and these each sell for $4.99. Give you a look at the reading level and what the illustrations are like. These have two color illustrations. This one is purple and black. Zoe is staying with her great aunt when she discovers a magical world full of fairy unicorns. But soon Zoe finds out that Unicorn Island is in terrible danger. Can Zoe and her new unicorn friend, Astra, save the island before it's too late? So Fairy Unicorns is recommended for ages seven and up. And my eight-year-old loved this book and can't wait to get the other five. The Adventures of Alfie Onion by Vivian French. This is a paperback book that sells for $5.99. Most of these books will also be available in library binding later on, they just aren't yet. Alfie is recommended for ages seven and up, just like the fairy unicorns. And here's a look inside at the text. This is also an illustrated book. Maybe not quite as many illustrations as the Fairy Unicorns book. Alfie Onion is setting out on a great adventure. His brother, Magnifico, is off to make the family's fortune and Alfie's carrying the luggage. But it turns out that Magnifico hates adventures and Alfie has to save the day with a little help from his loyal dog, a talking horse, two mice, and the meddling magpies. This next one is called Uncle Sean and Bill and the Almost Entirely Unplanned Adventure. And this is for ages eight and up. I would say that this book has a lot more illustrations in it than Alfie Onion does. And I think the text is a tiny bit bigger also. Um, Badger Bill needs rescuing. He's been kidnapped by two nasty sisters who are about to make him fight a boxing match against three even nastier dogs. Four de very depressed llamas need rescuing too. They're about to be turned into llama pies. But never fear, Uncle Sean is here, or near anyway. He loves rescuing things. He has a sort of plan which involves dancing and a mother mole and an electric fence. What could possibly go wrong? So you can see lots of kind of comical, fun looking illustrations in this one. My eight year old hasn't read this one yet, but looking it over, I think she's going to love it. Uncle Sean and Bill. And the last book I have for you today is The Cherry Pie Princess. And this paperback also sells for $5.99. It's recommended for ages seven and up. Let's take a look inside. Again, it has some nice illustrations on a lot of the pages. I think any one of these books would be good for your reluctant reader who doesn't like to just have a wall of text to look at. Princess Peony has a bad feeling that her father might be a tyrant. 
Josh doesn't really want to believe it, but he has a nasty habit of throwing people in dungeons. There's a royal party coming up, and the king's in an even worse mood than usual. He flat out refuses to invite the wicked hag, which can only mean one thing. Trouble! The Cherry Pie Princess. 